by Chanakale. Brilliant place. Great people. Got some supplies. The, the fishing, the, the uh, shipping lanes. Which is what we're coming up to here, which is what we crossed over to come on. And um, it's always busy. When we came over on the way in, it did. It felt like peak hour, didn't it? It was really, it was busier than this. And this is busy enough. But Chanakale is really great. If you're coming to Turkey, come here. A lot of history. This is where they've got the castles on both sides to protect them from inland and sea. And it's where they sunk two of the British ships. And Anne's on the helm at the moment, just taking us across the shipping lane, which is a good idea. And then I'll be taking her up the canal. No sails, of course, you can't have sails up. There's the mine sweeper that did all the damage to the English when I laid the mines and blew a few of their ships up. Hi, got to be super switched on here. Just set this ferry go. We got another one coming there. We... Keep an eye on him. We got this big ship coming down on top of us down here too. He's right up through there. Can't see it. Maybe you can film it. Okay, as soon as this fella goes, we're going to cross the lanes. Should be done now. There he goes. shipping lanes in the world. Be good up there, kids. I wouldn't worry about that until we get back to where we're going, Kerry. You don't want that to start flying around now. Leave it. Curiosity killed the cat. Huh? Curiosity killed the cat.
shipping lane now. No ships. They come down quick, don't they? Well, here we are, a great little um, anchorage that uh, Lou and Rick from Salacious Star recommended. It's on the island of Boscata, and uh, we, we've been up to Anzac Cove, and we're on our way back down to Chesmere. And um, yeah, we called we called in on the way up, and we called in again on the way back. Great little spot, lovely little spot. We're off that way in the morning. Good morning. So we've left Boss Carter just on our way back to Cheshmere over, what is it, 100 nautical miles? 100 nautical miles. Yeah. So we both had an early night last night under our new doona. It's yeah, good, eh? <laughs> which we absolutely love. It's really big and light and warm and all cosy. Boat's running well. Little issue with the hand control for the anchor chain, which makes it a bit tricky in shallow waters. <laughs> Sorry, that's just the radio. <clears throat> yeah. And um, we've just got to relabel. <laughs> got to re relabel the uh, control panels. Some of the switches were wired in grease incorrectly. So running lights are steaming lights, anchor lights are something else. But anyway, we're on top of that. And the sun's just coming up. We need to get some wind today. Yeah, no, we're good. There's the washing. I hung the washing out last night. Still a bit damp this morning, so while we're under motor and steaming, we're just going to let it dry off and then I'll bring it in before we put the sails up. Hey, Ian. Yeah. Anyway, it's time for a cup of coffee. 
Yes, coffee, please be good, thank you. Yeah, thanks. I have two sugars in mine then. Yeah, Yeah, not a problem. We have another ship coming in here. That's pretty good. We got out of there okay. It was all right. It's a bit of, bit of traffic, eh? Yeah, yeah, it was dark when we came out. It's all good. It's what your AIS and Navy Onyx is for. I don't know if you can see that. There we are there. Alright, I'm going to go make a coffee. Good. Thank you.